morning. It is Sunday. We didn't say um, good night to the vlogs last night. <laughs> we showered and just kind of died. But anyway, um, it is nine o'clock. Woke up really late. My sleep was okay. I was super tired, but it was okay because I was freaking out. Um, I got. Let me show you. So we got two pillows here, right? So I got my pillow on the side. I was here, and I tried my best to cover myself here, so I don't see anything on this side. And then I was facing that way and completely covered with the blanket because I was scared of the grudge. <laughs> the closet is behind us. I could have covered my head too. But anyway, um, I was so freaking hot because of it. I was completely covered, so it was a horrible thing. But anyway, oh, I'm hungry. It's nine o'clock and um, most places on Sundays don't really open that early. Good morning, babe. So when we slept, um, we shut all those um, little door thingy, but we left the light on. Maybe that's another reason um, I didn't sleep well, it was so bright. We're about to leave the hotel room. We forgot to show this to you last night or yesterday. So I just got this little rake. So what's the purpose? It's just relaxing, babe, when you just kind of fix the sand, you rake it. Supposed to, it's a sand garden. You rake it to make it all flat and everything. <clears throat> Give it those patterns. And I don't think they're supposed to be like all the sands here. Probably some people just ended up throwing sands up there and stuff. And over it there. Like footprints over there. Footprints? Oh. I think someone put like stone inside those little things. I don't think there's, there's supposed to be stones and sand on there. Uh -uh. So, but yeah, it's cool. There's a bunch of hair over here you can rake out. <laughs> See that? Hair from the grudge. Babe! <laughs> this is a hand washing station. It's kind of neat. We're having Korean for lunch. We are here. Yeah. <clears throat> Here's what's up to the bun me after we already started eating it. But yeah, there's some sweet potato right there. It's really good. And the tea. Food's here. There's the. It's a. I can't remember what it's called. It's a bean bao. Dosa. This is dosa bibimbap. Dosa bibimbap. And then sundobi. It's like a beef sundobi. Sundobi. So to me, that's not a valid point. So, you, he can tie. He, I, can, so the sword, getting the right spot under the tatsubi, and tie his body. So the way we show the body hit is called tumakome. It's a foot stomp. Okay. So that has to hit the same time I'm hitting here, the correct spot, and I'm yelling the same time. So again, if I ki men, I hit and my foot are not together. Men! Okay. That's not a valid point. Francesca's driving now. Uh, 
I'm gonna take a nap. So I'm tired. It's gonna be bored. Yeah. We're stopping changing drivers. Rainy's driving again. It's pretty warm outside. There's like snow everywhere. Dirty snow. Because we're up in the mountain. But it's pretty warm. Probably 34 minutes till we get home about. Can't wait to see my puppies. Or my babies. All baby cakes. Yay. All baby cakes. <laughs> Hi. Hi. Thank you. <laughs> So our babies are here. Haru jumped up and hit me right here. I I don't know if you guys can see you? that. No, he hit me with his head because he I was looking down and he jumped up and hit me right here on the cheek. It's still stinging right now. Is it red? Like right here, like right on the cheek though. But anyway. There they are. Oh, what are you doing on top of my bag? Come climb. Hi, Yuji. Hi. Did you like it there? Hey, <laughs> baby Yuji. Haru. Haru. I got you a toy. I got you and Yuji a toy. camera looks so weird um, I think the setting has been changed by accident by us just carrying it around we don't have to mess with it I mean I think it looks different based on me looking through the screen when I'm like videotaping other stuff sorry if it looks bad Yuchi. before we left San Francisco we went to the Super Mira store in Japantown and we decided to get some bento box that, um, that the grocery made because we've always wanted to try those. They look really good and that way we don't have to worry about um, our dinner. So um, Randy picked up three pieces of, um, not karage, what's this thing, uh, gyoza. The, the soy sauce kind of spilled but it didn't come out of the packaging. So that's good. And then the mochi from yesterday, um, still here. And then I picked this up. Um, I think that's a. Oh, it tells you Chirashi Sushi. And then, oh, cool, there's fish in there. And then some potato salad. Don't know what that is. Some egg. So cool. I picked that up. And then over here, Randy got some. Tendon, shrimp, and veggie, vegetable. <laughs> um, and then I also picked this up. This is prote potato croquette. I think that's how you pronounce it. Or cro yeah, I think that's how you pronounce it. I think it's just mashed potatoes um, and then breaded and fried. And then Rainy also got karage. Um, this size was filled with karage, but he was hungry while we were driving, so he already ate all those. So, and oh, I picked this up too. Um, it's a green tea. Never had this one before, so um, picked that up because um, we didn't think we'd have enough water. So, um, but we did. Um, so yeah, that would be for dinner later. I'll just heat it up. Oh, and we also got bread from Super Mira. Bread right here. I mean, it's not cheap for 38 for that, but um, I don't know about you guys, but I feel like Asian bread and American bread are very different. The texture is different. The taste is different too. I prefer the Asian one. I don't know because I'm Asian maybe. Do you notice any difference, Randy? Asian bread versus um, American. Softer, sweeter? Sweeter and softer. I don't really know how to describe it. I just know mm -hmm. I think it's better. Me too. I'm getting my sandals. Your what? Sandals. Or slippers? Sandals. Slippers? Or sandals. I have this from Daiso for you guys. It's gonna last about 20 minutes. At least it's only a dollar fifty. Mm. 
You don't want it? I'm sure you will want it later. All that mess already. How long did it last? Less than five minutes, right? Mm -hmm. You guys killed it. Made a mess. You can cut off the red part and just give them the rope. I do. Oh. Touch my toe. Wait. Wait. Gotta clean up your mess now. Hey, hey, hey. I thought it would have been worth a dollar fifty because it's a dollar fifty. But like it was like two minutes. It's dead. So maybe it's not worth it. <laughs> You dear, you itchy. You have itchy face? You have itchy face? Having some cereal. I just have my my regular an almond milk. Babe, what are you doing? This thing scratched the shit out of the floor. Hmm? This thing scratched the shit out of the floor. Oh no. And how did you know this? Because the chair was making a weird noise. I was like, what the hell is going on? So I came down here to look at it, and then this thing was just planted in the ground. I'm gonna be in a lot of trouble. Where is that how thing? it did that. Because it, it, it goes up here. See this one? Missing? But somehow it's like underneath one of these and it's supposed to be above it. How the hell did that happen? I'm just eating one of the potato croquette here. Is that how you pronounce it, babe? Croquet. Croquet? Mm. Mm. Let's, let's see if it's good. Is it potato? I think it's curry flavored. Mm. Maybe? Because it's kind of yellow. Yeah. Hmm. I don't think it's curry. Well, anyway, it's not bad. It's good. It's kind of oily. Babe, you should clean it first so you don't spread the thing. Ew, babe. The YouTube people heard that. Um, right when I woke up this morning, I couldn't wait to just eat and come home. I love going on vacation. You don't do it often too, in my opinion. Um, but um, I love going home. I was telling Randy, I just like to... The, our home is comfortable because that's where we always are, where our babies are. For the weekend, I'm not going to tell you who said it. Because I don't know. If, I don't want to get anybody in trouble. I don't know if that's like... Yeah, anyway, I'm not telling you who said it, but over the weekend, Randy and I met someone who works at, um, what does he do? Um, he makes medicine. He's not the scientist who, who invents medicine. He's the, the, the person who puts it together. It's like he got all the ingredients and he puts it together and make that pill form. Um, he makes, I guess, Specifically, cancer drugs. And he said that there's probably a cure for cancer, but drugs company would not let that come out because then they will be out of money. And the drug company is like running the world, it appears. So when he makes the drugs, um, I guess there's only a couple of specks or drops of the actual medicine into the pill. Most of the pill is just, what What would you call it, like a filler? Yeah. So it's so crazy. And then I also talked to, um, not this weekend, but like in the past, I talked to a student, a, I don't know if the students I met is gonna be pharmacists or just pharmacy assistants or something like that, but they were gonna work at the pharmacy. And they said that drugs are probably like 
forgot the exact price, but she said super, super cheap, like a dollar or less, and they sell it for, you know how much, like how much you pay for your drugs when you go pick it up. So much more, but she said it's so cheap. So it's so crazy. Makes me not want to take it even more. Too bad I'm kind of stuck with my birth control, but maybe I don't even want to take Advil. So shout out to our new subscriber, Kimberly P. Hi, Kimberly P. <laughs> and Randy ate um, the bento stuff already. Um, pretty much all of it, except the big one for me. Mm. Um, and you, he said he really liked it, right? Yeah, it was good. Okay, we're gonna watch an anime. What anime are we gonna watch? Boku no Hero Academia. What's that? Is it something new? Or we're we've on seen? Like the third episode. Oh. Or is it? Yeah, third episode. Uh, okay, well, I don't remember which one that is, but. Okay, let's watch it. What you doing in your cage, Haru? What are you doing in there? About to heat up my Japanese food. It's in this little container and it's wrapped with saran wrap, so that's pretty cool. Um, that way it doesn't spill. Randy's listening to his favorite radio station, Rob Anybody and Don, correct? He always listens to that. So the green daifuku is uh, mugwort. What? Mugwort. What's a mugwort? It's like some leaf. Mm. So um, we were vlogging Saturday. We tried this mochi, but not mochi thing. And there was a green one that I didn't like, the white one I liked. And Randy said that the green one is mugwort. I said that right? Mugwort. Which is a type of leaf. I guess I don't like that leaf. Oh, this is plastic, so I can't heat it up. Oh, I guess I'll have to transfer it. Sucks. Heated up my food. I have to transfer it to a different plate because like I said, it's plastic. I couldn't microwave it. Um, I did microwave the potato salad because I, you don't do that. Um, and then the orange. So the rest was microwave. So I got the rice here, egg, and this is a fish. I forgot what type of fish now, but it's breaded fish and I want to say pickled something. And I have no idea what that is. I have no idea what that is, but I'll eat them all. Uh, if I don't like them, I don't have to finish them, but I will try them. Just finished dinner, but I didn't finish all of the food. Um, it's more than I thought for me. Um, but I'm gonna just save some of it. It's not much that I didn't awesome. eat, but I will save them because I'm not to waste food. Um, but. This is the only thing I couldn't eat. I tried it maybe two or three times and I think it's a sea vegetable with some beans and some other stuff, but I don't like it. It's way too fishy for me. And then the egg, I like it, but I'm just too full. So I'm gonna save that for tomorrow. And then I ate most of the potato salad. I don't eat potato salad because I don't like mayo, but the Japanese mayo, I can eat. Um, but um, I ate about three of the cucumbers, but I don't like the, the rest of them. So um, I'm just gonna save the egg and this rice. I'm gonna eat the piece of orange right now. It's been like hours. How do you start here? And Yuji is also sleeping upstairs on top of the luggage. It puts music on so he won't notice that I left. So that I can grab my camera and get him to you. So there's Yuji. Yuji, what are you doing? That's our clean clothes. That's our clean clothes. And you're super dirty. I'm exhausted. Um, so yeah, I think that would be it. I feel like I'm forgetting to tell you guys something, but it's the end of the night, gotta go to sleep. Um, I'm gonna catch up on It's Judy's Life. I haven't watched her vlog for like a week, so I have a few to watch. Um, so yeah, I will see you guys next weekend. I'll vlog again Saturday and you'll see it Sunday. So we'll see you guys then, bye.